The MTA is using artificial intelligence to combat a $700 million fare evasion problem that can look something like this. And so that's backhawking. The Metropolitan Transportation Authority recently disclosed that it is using AI technology that combines surveillance video with MetroCard and Omni data to help quantify how much money it's losing in unpaid subway fares. With about 16% of all subway riders skipping out on their fares, MTA Chairman Jano Lieber is defending the aggressive new approach. With $700 million a year now being lost, this is a serious threat to the MTA. MTA officials said they're only using the AI software to count the number of fare beaters in the system and not to identify them. But subway rider Malcolm Combs isn't convinced. They say they are using it for that, but you never know. It changes here and there. I feel like it's a kind of a gateway if you kind of allow it. The MTA has also said it has no plans to bring the technology over to the Long Island Railroad. But privacy advocate Albert Fox Kahn, who uncovered some of the details of the MTA's AI operation, believes it's just a matter of time before similar technology will be used to keep track of LIRR riders who don't pay their fares. Manhattan may be the epicenter of New York surveillance, but it tends to spread out. And we've seen NASA and Suffolk Police Departments uh, using many of the same surveillance tools that once were only thought to be something for the NYPD. Although most of the MTA's fare evasion problem is on the subways and buses, it's still also very much a problem on the Long Island Railroad as well. Last year, the railroad lost $24 million to fare evasion, and the railroad says about a third of all its fares are either collected incorrectly or not collected at all. For News ATV, I'm Alfonso Castillo.